unfortunately, it is our last Broadway buzz for this semester, but I can assure you, you will not be disappointed. The National Theatre of London presents the play This House, written by James Grahams. It takes us back to the period of 1974 to 1979 in the UK. This new play strips politics down to their practical realities of those behind the scenes who roll up their sleeves and on occasion bend the rules. It's a time when a staggering number of politicians die and age-old traditions and allegiances are thrown aside in the struggle for power. Lucky for you, you will not have to travel all the way across the pond because this broadcast is coming to you live at Pollock Theater on May 22nd at 7.30 p.m. This is one you will definitely not want to miss. Heading over to the streets of Broadway, I hear much buzz about some talented actors hitting the stage. One actor in particular, Nathan Lane, is making his return to Broadway. He is starring in The Nance, which tells the story of Chauncey Miles, a headline Nance performer and New York burlesque who also happens to be a homosexual. Here you can see the Nance living and working in a secretive gay world in the 1930s and trying to cope with his messy offstage life. This tender, moving, and unspeakably funny play is directed by three-time Tony Award winner Jack O'Brien. So if you're looking for some good laughs made by the hilarious Nathan Lane, I would definitely recommend seeing this show. It is currently playing on Broadway. Moving right along to another top Broadway play is Peter and the Starcatcher. It is based off of the old legend of Peter Pan, one of my all-time favorite Disney stories. It is wildly theatrical, hilarious, and innovative retelling of how a miserable orphan came to be the boy who never grew up. It truly inspires the audience to stretch the limits of their imagination with inventive use of props and lighting. So don't miss one of our culture's most enduring and beloved characters and discover the Neverland you never knew. Peter and the Starcatcher is currently playing on Broadway. I have saved the best buzz for last. Are you ready for this? The popular 2012 film Magic Mike is being brought to the Broadway stage. For those of you who may not be familiar with this film, it tells the story of Mike Lane, a 19-year-old who is guided into the world of stripping by his mentor Dallas, played by Matthew McConaughey. It is still not confirmed if Channing Tatum and all the other steamingly confident men will star in this musical production. In addition, a sequel to this film is also in the works. I am not sure how I feel about this being a musical. However, I can only hope that it is striptastic. I will definitely keep you updated on this one. Also, don't forget to tune in to the Tony Awards airing on June 9th at 8 o'clock p.m. where you can get a peek of all the Broadway shows we have buzzed about this semester. See you next time for the latest updates from the Hawk's Nest to the Great White Way. Bye!